Well, we started a major project here on, at our Montana Haven homestead. Uh, we're taking out, we took out all the railings as you can see around here. And some of them were getting pretty old. We're getting ready, what we're getting ready to do is completely refinish this whole house. We're gonna media blast it with glass beads, get all the old stain off. Then we're going to uh, stain it and chink it. These wonderful artistic crooked posts kind of, I think, are, is time to move on to something more modern and straight. So we're gonna rip these out of here. We're replacing, eventually we're gonna replace the deck. We're just not really fond of this deck here. It was a bad move when we bought the deck. So we're actually gonna use rough cut two by eight that lumber that we cut, larch uh, boards that we cut at our mill. So we're ripping out the outside couple rows here so we can install the first couple rows of boards um, so when we put our new posts on later, we don't have to pull them off again to replace it. So that's what we're doing. We're trying to get rid of these, getting rid of the outside a couple rows, putting on the new couple rows, and then we're going to put a railing on and then move on from there. So it's, it's a job. Here we go. Okay. Beat this bad boy out of here. This roof doesn't come down on us, huh? Okay, look out. What we're trying to do here is we have to cut the bottom off a little bit to allow that to come down, but look at our braces just about ready to pop. I'm not sure what's gonna happen. This could be, this could be a little Western. thing because something else is in the way but in this case we had to put this brace up to hold that so we could put this take this post out of here so we can put that board there so we can put the new post on here so we're gonna knock this thing out of here and hope this holds keeps the roof from falling down here we go Bad. Get ready to run. Yeah. It worked. <laughs> Nothing happened. We're still alive. Well, hi Wyatt. Hi. We got a little bit of a start here. We got that one post in and we got the outside row done. We need to give this homestead a major, major, major facelift. It's been years since we stained it. Right now we're sta uh, sanding the corners. Um, because when we media blast, it won't, uh, it doesn't do well on the corner. So we're doing all the flats, we're sanding the flats. Then we're going to media blast the, um, uh, all the logs. And then we're going to give it a dark stain and going to, uh, give it a kind of mortar gray, mortar white color chinking. So we're, uh, excited to get this, start working on this. It's a huge project and I've been dreading it, but... Uh, since we started on it, i just excited to get it done. I want to get it done. So, got yeah, a lot of corners to sand. Lots to do, but eventually get there. Hopefully by the end of the summer, this thing will be completely look like a brand new house. Here's Paul, my renter down here. He's getting this underlayment put on here. Kind of like house wrap. It's a moisture vapor barrier. Sealing around the windows. And then we're going to put siding on here from up against the fascia there down to within about six inches of the bottom here. Then from here on down, we're gonna put uh, diamond mesh and a scratch coat of concrete in preparation for rocks for like next year. So he's getting all that done. He's gonna hang the siding for me. He's putting that sticky stuff around the windows. One thing we did, we used to have a door right here and he took that door out 
my initial thought when I built the house was to build put a greenhouse out underneath these posts out here, which was kind of a cool idea, but it, in reality didn't work that well. And then over here, we had a French door. And so we took this French door out and put a man door in, just a three foot regular door in there. So we've been, uh, had a sheet rocker guy out to fix the inside. So that's getting done. Hey, look at that, he's at work. He's got these windows all set here on the outside with trim. And he's getting ready to put siding on in a little while here. Look at that, there's Paul getting the siding on. That is pretty sweet. Love it. Wow, it's really nice here. It's getting done. This is almost done. This part over here is done. At the bottom here, we're going to be putting rocks. But for right now, he's just going to put a scratch coat on there. But wow, that's looking so good. Excited. We're um, going to get our porch deck done here, hopefully tomorrow. Justin carrying some wood because it's still snowing out. It's crazy. It's April and it's snowing, but that's how it is. This is the back side of the house here. It's got all that wrapped up. Man, that looks good. Watch your head in case that thing comes down on you. Oh, it held. There she goes. We are making progress. Wow. Working on this porch here. We are putting the new post in. And we've got all of these posts in now here. That's good. And we've got all of the outside on here. Going around here. We're almost getting there. Now we're going to have steps going off here. We ripped all of this railing, this old uh, porch decking off of here. And we're going to fill it up with dirt so it's, it comes up higher. And then we'll have some steps going off of here. Eventually we'll have landscaping going around the outside with a cement walkway. Concrete uh, steps from here all the way to the front of the house. But that's phase two or three. It's game time. Just look at how beautiful that looks. Goes from an old looking house to a new looking house. Now this is the side that we did yesterday and this is the side we have not done yet. So you can see the difference. It's pretty incredible. The old stain on this side versus the completely bare logs over here. It's absolutely stunning. Good morning, babe.
Wow. Well, we just wrapped up. Actually, just uh, wrapped up a few minutes before well, we had late dinner. <laughs> just got done eating dinner. Thought I'd come out and do a little bit of a video. But, yep, we blew everything off. Went all the way around again with the high-powered machine. Blew everything off. Wow, it's this... The logs look so nice. I wish we could just keep them like this, but the weather just turns them gray. So it's unfortunately now with this green here and eventually rocks at the bottom, it's going to look pretty good, I think. And then we're going to put rock along the bottom here. Right now, everything's kind of a mess, but we're getting there. Still have a ledger fascia board to put on the front here. That's how everything looks up there. Just kind of do a quick walk around. Hopefully next week or the week following we'll get the railing on, get this porch completely done the way we want it along the front here, get this fascia on, and then we'll be ready to stain. So what a project this was. We got it done in two days actually. We thought it might be a three-day project, but we worked like crazy and it's done. Wow, it's looking so nice. Can't wait to see the railing and the new stain on there. And here, you may have seen this before, but we sharp, shorten up the deck. I'm gonna have steps coming off of there, get rid of those pillars. This was just an unusable deck. It was a good idea, but it wasn't practical. So, there it is. We did have a little bit of dust come around some of the windows, so that's why we had to blow off the inside. Just figured it'd be easier than vacuuming everything. A little bit like camping, had a little bit of a beach inside. Anyways, that's how it looks. We're excited to go to the next part and get this thing done and move on to other things in life. 